guys so in today's video we are going to play with Pat McGrath um, I did a haul a while ago only bought I believe four items from her um, which was two eyeshadow three eyeshadow palettes two of the little ones with this in the plastic case and then this one here and then a lipstick set um, or dual lipstick, which is these sets here, which I did wear one um, in a previous video. So, my biggest fear is to really love and enjoy Pat McGrath. Because right now, Pat McGrath is the most expensive uh, makeup I have seen so far when it comes to palettes. Um, I don't even know if there's anyone to compare to her. You know, I do have a thing for um, Natasha Denona. I do like her stuff. Um, Jeffree Star is his own person, but with their palettes, with me paying 50 or $60, I get multiple amounts. Um, now, even though everybody's on their own tier, okay, with Jeffree Star, I think his is $52, but you get, oh God, about, I can't even explain, I, mean, I can't even think of how many you get, I haven't touched the palette in a while, but you get more than 15 if I have it correctly on his palettes. Um, Natasha Denona. Oh, baby, where is your palette? I don't even know where her palette is. But it's somewhere on this mess of a bed. But with her palette, oh, I'm sitting here looking at it. I didn't realize I put it back in the box. With her palette for $65 um, of these smaller ones, and this is the one that I have with me right now, you get uh, 15 colors for $65. And then you have <laughs> Pat McGrath, where, if I have it correctly, this is $65 full price. You get six sheets. Like her 10 shade, her 10 pan shades are $125 or $129. I'm not sure which one it is. I really do want one, but I just cannot pay that amount of money for it at this time. I just cannot. I just cannot. So I'm so terrified to get hooked on her stuff. But I did want to try it out because I bought it. Um and I haven't tried it out yet. So that is what we're going to do in this video. And this is the Mothership Sublime Golden Opulence Eyeshadow Palette. I'm not sure exactly which name it is. So we're just going to read everything. Her packaging, I think, is stunningly beautiful. It makes me think of... Nope. Every time I think of something, it just flies out of my head. Especially when I'm talking to you guys. Um... Dorothy with the red shoes. It is just beautiful. Y'all yeah, know red is one of my favorite colors. Red and blue are my top two colors that I like. So, with that being said, we're going to play in this palette today and try to find something. Um, I really don't want to get rid of my bases <laughs> or my primers. So, we're going to use this primer here. And this is from Sephora. And then we're just going to put um, concealer on top of it. And go from there. I'm just going to have to get used to it. Using, um, putting on, God. Putting on eyeshadow palette without a base works for me. Or well, primer works for me. Um, I'm going to say more so a primer and not a base because my base. Um, I don't feel like scooting back so I may fall off my chair. But uh, my base that I use in my little jar. I really like and it's very smooth and it doesn't feel like um, I'm tugging on my skin when I do apply eyeshadow um, this base here and the pretty vulgar base it's it just or primer primer not base it's just it, it is I don't 
I don't think I'm doing something right with it is what I'm going to say. And it makes it, I feel that when I'm using, um, when I use these, that it's, it's, um, it's, the brush is pulling on my skin. Like it makes it like so dry feeling that it's just really pulling my eye. And I could be wrong. It, it could be me. I know I blame everything on myself, but I don't know. I don't know. But this is from Sephora. It is the Tinted and Cooling Eye Primer. And I don't know what's cooling about it because I don't feel a cooling effect to it. But this is in 02 Matte Pink Beige is what it is. And so we're going to dot you, dot you, because you don't need that much of this and let us smooth that out and go from there i should have did my little thing i i actually now i don't have time to do it all the time like if i was going out or something like that i have to start my makeup early um to do my eyebrows to conceal it but i really did like um the outlook of that video when I concealed um, my eyebrows around my eyebrows and y'all know I do not do that very often at all at all and as you see my eyebrows are not done this eyebrow is just so much different from this one from this one this one actually it's just I have a scar here um, if you've never noticed it but I do have a scar here but then I also where it skips here I have a scar here when I was a kid I hit my head on a marble table and um, <laughs> ended up getting a gash so that's where that comes from here Okay, so let's get started because y'all know I can talk for 20 hours. If y'all let me, well, you know what I mean. You know what I mean. Y'all pray I don't get any issues. I went to the dentist today. I'm getting um, implants put in. It's not in yet, but they did put the do the first step with putting the um, screws in. So I don't know if, I don't think you can get dry socket from that. That wasn't a discussion that we had. Um, I just know I cannot drink out of a straw or anything like that or have potato chips and certain things I cannot eat. So I ate french fries. And for you, those those of you that do not know, french fries is my favorite food to eat at this moment in time and has been for years. Um, and if I have to be honest, I like a lot of anything that really has to do with potatoes. I think it is awesome. I like. I like. Like, even this plastic here just has a difference to it. You know, it's just... Y'all don't judge me, okay? Don't judge me. Oh, I am holding this wrong. We're going to hold it upside down like this. So, let's look at the colors once again. And so, the, um, I mean, you can get at least, well, you can get four different eye looks with this. With everything will be the same base. But, um, you can get four different looks due to the glitters or the shimmers. Um, we're going to do this and then I want to swatch it because I haven't swatched this palette yet as y'all probably can tell. But I'm telling y'all right now without even swatching it using this and the issues that I've had with the because I did do this. I don't know if I did the same thing with the Natasha Denona palette but I can tell you that um, with that base and stuff I did have an issue with it feeling like it was taking on my skin right now with this palette I do not have that issue maybe it was the brush maybe let's see 
there was not a lot of fallout when I do my usual, you know, stippling in here, which is great also. Okay, it wasn't the brush because this is the brush that I used when I first had an issue. Okay, let's get a little closer so you guys can see my eyes. With me using my phone, I can't zoom in with the way that I use it. Let's see, what is on my eye? Probably glue. Yeah, no, I'm still working on... Um, <laughs> eyelashes I did order some magnetic eyelashes I don't know if I had this conversation with y'all yet but I did order some magnetic eyelashes um, I hope these are great eyelashes because the amount of money I spent for it was ridiculous um, but we're gonna just let that be we're just gonna let it be we're just gonna let it be but I do hope it is easy process I'm pretty sure I'm still going to have to uncurl my lashes um, to even operate it let me tell you something the fact that like I'm even doing it hard you know it's it there is no fallout Jesus Christ Pat Pat don't do this to me don't don't do this to me okay but I'm gonna I'm gonna tell y'all hands down that this is the best feeling eyeshadow palette I have used on my eye right now um, the fact that one, there's no fallout, all my palettes I have ever used so far, the majority of them, 99% of them have fallout, um, a pieciness to it. This doesn't, this, it, it does not, it, it does not guys, it does not. And that's all I can see. I don't know how much more I can see that, but it does not. It blends very well. Also, okay, 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 okay. We're going to use, I was going to use the same brush, but I do need a smaller one. Um, let us try this one, and we're going to use, okay, so the color that we use, we're going to try to figure it out. It's uh, Tranquility, and now we're going to use Prosperity. I like the names in here. Now, Prosperity does have a little bit of kick up to it, but not a lot. Um, and you can see it, but it's not moving in the pan, if that makes sense as well. Um, now, Prosperity used to be our dog's name. And do y'all see this, the payoff on this? Do y'all see that? Pat, don't do this to me. I like it. I, 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 oh God, I like this. I, I think Pat needs to have a bomb sale because I just, $125. It's just, I, oh God. And let me say this. It's very hard for me to be able to see different colors when I do my makeup. And I know a lot of it has to do with me. I know a lot of it has to do with me, but the fact that it blends out so wonderfully, and I'm y'all know this is saying a lot coming from me because I am a point zero zero one artist. I don't know much, okay. I just learn as I go, and we just kind of learn together. You know, we just kind of learn together as I go, and I do feel like it feels a little rough. Um, but I'm not going to, well, I know it's not the palette. Um, I know it's not the palette. And I'm just trying to make it even looking. 
And I know I can't do this too long because, God, my head starts to hurt. For some reason to me, I can get this eye better than this eye. And I don't know why. I don't know why. But this blending is beautiful. It's blending beautifully. It is blending beautifully. Now y'all know, I'm going to have to go higher, and I do hate that, but unfortunately the way my eyes are shaped, which is why I need to stop using 175 different colors, because it makes no sense, it makes no sense whatsoever. Okay, so we are going to, everybody, we're not going to cut anything, we're just going to add to it. So we need a bomb. Well, we got the mini bomb brushes like that. Yeah, I know all my brushes come from my um, subscription boxes. More so Ipsy and BoxyCharm. Any other brushes I get in from any other boxes, I really keep them because they just don't work too, too great to me. Some of them I just don't like. Um, hmm. So... Let's use, we're going to use two different colors. Do you not want to work for me? Okay, so I don't know if it's going to work well with the brush. <laughs> so I'm pushing in it and it's almost like it's squishy. Oh, can y'all see that? Okay, these seem like they are meant to be put on with your fingers. Okay. Y'all see the difference between the brush and my finger? Okay. Do y'all see that? I like it. I like it. Okay, so um it sucks with the brush and it could just be my choice of brush. Um, but they say a lot of shimmers from what I hear. And what I've gathered and learned that a lot of shimmers um, do work better, um, especially with different qualities of shimmers work better um, with applying them with your fingers. Um, and I've seen with more high end, it is because of how soft and creamy they are. It's better to, um, it's more payoff when you do it with your fingers. So... That is what we're going to do on this side. No need to try with that brush. My problem is, though, with the whole using the finger, is that I like to get my nails done. And I don't like my nails this short. As my natural nails are right now. Um, so it's just, it's difficult to do it with nails, long nails on. It's difficult for me to do it with long nails on. Um, 
but these feel so nice. Okay, so since we're here, let us go ahead. They do feel nice. Though. They do feel nice on the fingers. Um, I, it's hard for me to describe. It is, it is a creaminess to them. But when you're rubbing your hands in it, it, it's like it's so creamy that it can get bunched up or blotchy. Or if that makes sense. Probably doesn't make sense how I said it um, <laughs> at all. But, yes, these are the shimmers. Tell me that these are not beautiful shimmers. Tell me that they're not beautiful shimmers. Okay, so we're going to try, I don't even know, we're going to, we're going to try another brush. Um, we're going to try another brush. Let's try this one. Let's try this one. And see. Oh. It works with this brush. Okay, so. Well, maybe it doesn't work too much. Hold on, y'all ain't about to stop with me today, okay? Okay, no, that was my imagination. But we're gonna try to make it work. Anyway, you do, you can't see something can see something. Okay. And that is don't do that. The eye look that we're doing today with this palette. Guys, real talk though, hands down. Like, <laughs> I, I really like this palette. Like, I really, really like this palette. And I can understand why people love that. I can really understand why people love that. Okay. Do we need to turn this up some? Oh, well, we turned it down. So let's turn it down since it's already off. And then let us turn it up. Now, I don't know if you could see the difference in that because that was bright in my eyes. So, okay. I, I just, my videos are just long. And, you know, I, I just, they're just long. But with that being said, I am completely in love with the quality of this palette and with this palette in general. Like if I was going on vacation, I would only need to take this one. Um, yeah, I would only need to take this one because I can get at least four different looks with this. With this. And as you know, that is completely awesome completely awesome and if I didn't want to you know darken it at all I don't even have to use this one you know it, it's just there's a few choices that you can have and I'm excited about that okay so I'm not gonna do my whole face or anything like that because I really just don't feel like washing all that stuff off nor do I wish having this video any longer than what it is um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video y'all let me know what y'all think down below in the comment section um how you feel about this palette what do you think about this palette are you even thinking about buying anything for pet because pet is very much a high-end uh brand and that is it um my mouth is starting to hurt mm, my mouth is starting to hurt so i am going to get off here i love you guys dearly i appreciate you guys so much i hope y'all are having a great start of the week and I hope you're having a great week all together. And that life is just serving you guys very well. Um, 
And until the next video, I will talk to you beautifully different, lovely people later. Mm -hmm. Love you guys. Bye.